All of you have the idea of lines, parallel lines and angles. If you look around yourself in your surroundings, you will see enormous use of lines and angles. The best example is your home. Have a look. The corners of walls of the room are straight lines perpendicular to the lines at the bottom, thus making an angle of 90 degrees. The roof of the room has two pairs of parallel lines. In fact, the roofs of a home are made using iron rods which are arranged in the form of parallel lines, horizontally and vertically to give strength to the roof. Now have a look at this house. These types of houses have slant roofs, that is, the roofs are inclined at an angle with each other to prevent water from getting stagnant and piling of snow. One other example is the railway tracks. The tracks are made of parallel iron rods to prevent derailment. By now you have seen the uses of lines and angles in real life. Now it is the time to see what has been covered in this chapter. Axioms related to parallel lines. Angle sum property of triangles. Exterior angle property of triangles. In order to excel in geometry, you must understand this chapter well as lines and angles are the base of geometry.